END here. Usually we don't disturb those that rest in peace. It's a sign of respect to leave those that left this world in their restful peace. But not on Innistrad, not on Innistrad. Because on Innistrad we do disturb those that rest in peace for our benefit. Disturb is a new mechanic introduced in Innistrad Midnight Hunt. It's a keyword ability connected to creatures resurrected in spirit form. Spells with Disturb can be cast from the graveyard transformed for their Disturb cost. But how do you play Disturb? It's quite easy. Each creature with the Disturb ability will be a double face card. And if a card is in your graveyard, you can cast it by paying the Disturb cost. Disturb provides you with an alternative cost with an amount of mana you have to pay. In very simple words, you are just casting the backside of the card. Unlike every other transforming double face card seen so far, like the Daybound, Nightbound Werewolves, which can transform depending on the progress of the game. Let's start our tutorial and cast the Voted Craft Keeper. The Voted Craft Keeper, one white and one blue, it's a 2-1 human peasant. Because the Voted Craft Keeper is in my hand, I can only cast the front side of the card. I cannot cast the back side of the card, only the front side. Paying the step cost while it's in your hand doesn't work, so only the front side. It's a creature spell, goes on the stack, there can be a response, there can be a counter, nothing happens, it hits the battlefield. Enter the battlefield's ability kicks in and I will mill two cards. As much as the Voted Craft Keeper is on the battlefield, I cannot transform it. There is no way you can transform a disturbed creature into its other side while it's on the battlefield. But if the Voted Craft Keeper dies and goes in the graveyard, so the Voted Craft Keeper is in, the, in my graveyard, just a second, it's in my graveyard. While the Voted Craft Keeper is in my graveyard, then I can pay one one white and one blue, the disturb cost, and cast it. When I cast the Votograph Keeper or any disturb creature from the graveyard, it will go on the stack. There can be a counter or any response. If nothing happens, the Votograph Keeper will hit the battlefield transform into the parted soul keeper. So as I said, goes on the stack, there can be a counter, there can be a response, nothing happens. I will not put the Votograph Keeper in play, but I will put Departed Soul Keeper, the backside of the card. Once Departed Soul Keeper is on the battlefield, there is no way to transform it back to Devoted Graph Keeper. There is no way. The only way you can transform Departed Soul Keeper is by a flicker. Remember that flickering double face cards will always return them faced up. A small note to conclude, it seems that each disturbed creature will not go into the graveyard if they are destroyed. They will be exiled. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you learned something about this new disturb mechanic from Innistrad Midnight Hunt. Here's the subscription button. Subscribe to my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the collectible world.